welcome today i'm creating a video on how to create an apple id on all the devices like iphone 6 i have using right now uh, or it could be ipad that facing the error while creating new apple id that your account could not be created so i'll show you what error we face but before i do that and i would request please subscribe this channel if you find this video helpful if you haven't subscribed yet so if you go in settings and you say create apple id and one two three uh, there you go C uh, could not create apple id this phone has this iphone has been used to create too many blah 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 so this is the error you're facing on ipad and iphone as well and i'll show you the solution how you can get around it and you can create apple id while while you're running ios 10 11 or 12 on all the devices doesn't matter if it's ipad or iphone so all you have to do is click here and then you see here it says create new apple id so you click there and it's gonna take a moment and here it says enter your email address and password that you want to keep for your new account so i'll just remove the phone for a few seconds you know from the screen and i'll be right with you okay email address and password You know, a lot of people while making the video, what they do is they blur this information and you can, you can do that too, but I decided to move the phone so I can keep my personal information the same. Nobody can use my Apple ID and download some paid apps. Almost done. I'm just entering the password and then click next. Okay, so I have entered the password and now it says you must agree to the Apple Media Services. These are terms and conditions that you have to agree. You cannot deny them. And then I press OK and it says email address is valid because I did not put gmail.com so my bad okay go next and agree to terms and conditions and hopefully no more errors so go to you have to agree to terms and conditions so you make sure you slide this button now it's asking the first name and last name so you can enter your first and last name okay data word so i'm just going to make it up data word so that's why so I don't have to hide the phone, you know, from you guys. Okay, so it doesn't. And then you have to choose three questions. What was the name of your best friend as a teenager? So why not girlfriend, just friend? Okay, so I would say Tina. Question two. What is your favorite? Mm, what was the model of your first motorized vehicle? Okay. Why not? Lexus. Okay, question number three. Uh, favorite sports team? 
And now it's a Raptors. And then click on next. And now it's asking all the information for your payment method. So you can click none right now and go next. But you still have to go for the address. So let me just put the address and I'll be right with you. Okay. So it's just asking my personal information, that's why uh, I moved the phone. And hopefully it won't take too long. And you click next. All right, I'm back. And now, now it says you have to enter the verification code, which was sent to your email that you used. So let me check on my laptop if I received the code. I'm just trying to log into my laptop. I, was, I wasn't ready for it, so just go ahead and let me do it. Okay, I got the code and it says 754802. So 754802. So it's just going to verify that you're the legit person, you're not creating the account. And there you go, it says Apple ID completed. So that's it guys uh, now you can continue and start downloading the uh, your apps or whatever you want to do with the, your iphone or ipad and thank you very thank you very much for watching and see you later in the next video